today, I'm going to talk about self-massage. So uh, my feet have been aching a bit, so I figured out I'm at a nice park, a place called the Duck Ponds in Gympie, and I'm going to show you a little bit how to do self-massage. So when your feet are sore, I often start right near here. And of course, I'll do another one where I show how to use tools. That's my little baby in the background, by the way. But we can work right along the edge of the toe like this. There's a band coming through here, both the big toe belly band and the big toe sacrum band. So we can work up like this. She's just wanting me to do a big massage video. We can follow that right up into here. Right up the leg. Into the calves. We can also work underneath the toe, so getting right in under here, through here, and across here, right into here. We can pull toes, we can work in like this. So working in through here, we can get that point there and move the toe. It's a very important area right through here. We can use our knuckles. sacrum band. So the big toe belly band comes in through here, the big toe sacrum band comes through here. Yep, I've got dry heels, have had for many years. This is the big toe sacrum band then following up here. Oh, it's tight in there. Okay, so then we can work again right up into the middle. Here. pressure point between that little toe and the second one. Also these ones, so get all in. Click there. Work across here. You can also work all these tendons here. So this is just good if you're feeling a bit your feet are a bit sore, you can move them around. Just to help get rid of that build up of the day's worth of tension. Get into the cows, change feet. Again, pull the toes. Oh, that's good. Get in behind here. And all through here. Can work behind into that Achilles area. So I'm grabbing from both sides. It's good to be out in like a park in nature. Sometimes doing this too, it's quite grounding having the earth. Some nice grass. Okay, so just using that knuckle, or you could use all your knuckles. We can come in here right underneath the nail bed there. Work along.
bolt it here. So we're on the side, that's the bone there, we're on the side of the bone. Not on the, not beside the bone I should say. And we can over our legs like this. And then like I say, get right in underneath there. Shake so pressing both, moving top, and getting right into here. usually let my fingers do the walking wherever they feel needs to be done into here Over here so say you can use your knuckles Change your hands, a bit tired. And it's just a nice way to look after your feet. I will show you how to do that also with tools if you have them, I just didn't bring them today. But really focus on areas like this where the toes are meeting the foot underneath those toes. Stretch and twist the foot. Move the toes like this. It's really good at moving. You can even bash it a little bit. Done with a loose wrist so that it bounces. Stretch the foot, move it around. So you just want to stretch it, twist it. Bash, bouncing with a loose wrist. And then right up into where the foot joins the ankle, paying a lot of attention here. Alright, feet are starting to feel better. 